finishing the Angel Saga 3. These are some notes I've typed up. The Angel Saga is mostly finished. The Angel Saga is now complete in scope with 50 volumes. Some finishing off needs to be done. Okay. Possibly not finished, but Volume 50 is Earth Jubilee, and that is under control of its content. Volume 40 is the world of Pan Am, which hasn't yet been placed into the multiverse. It's one of the new multiverse universes. The Angel Saga of the World of Pan Am, Linus O'Neill, Volume 1 to 20, Volume 1, 20 something. This is the Blaver series stuff. Uh, so, Blaver would be uh, Linus O'Neill stuff. So, basically, um, uh, information here. The Blaver information possibly fits into the world of Pan Am in prehistory of Linus O'Neill. He might be a maternal great grandfather of Katniss. Yes, in my initial plan, which is not the final plan, Blaver is previously in the world of Pan, Pan Am. We'll just see how it goes. So, what, what I've written out on that is that Linus O'Neill is Katniss' mother's mother's father. He was a religious man of the A&M of the Pan Am world. He believes the resurrection of the dead will possibly happen one day, and has prayed many prayers to God. He equally believes that the world might just go on the way it is, and that possibly society is sinking down towards sin and a potential future conflict. He tries to raise his children with morality and values. After Linus comes his daughter, who has a line, possibly has a line in one of my videos, sequences of her information, and her daughter also has a line of information which she raises Katniss with, to ensure Katniss is a decent person. So basically, uh, 20 something is the Blaver series 1, 30 something is Blaver series 2, and Linus in his 20s and 30s. Okay. Alright. Right. Uh, going on. One of the ideas of the sermonology is preached in the Angel Saga and stories. Okay. Uh, Torah prophecies is Cherubim, Daniel Thomas, Sandra, Daily Theology from Terror to Judgment Day. They are sermonology which can be used in Daniel's preaching sermons to HNF, ANM, ANM or in discussions of various characters. Generally the different sequences and individual sermons can fit in here and there over the scope of the saga as a whole. It can be worked in as someone preaching over general conversations on theological issues. The public domain information from Wiki can possibly be used freely, possibly be used uh, but I have to process it well. The, the rest of my general info and worldly issues should be able to be worked in also. Technically, the comedy dolls could sort of fit in, but that'd probably have to be done in, in the movies, really. Uh, of course, most of the fanfic is in Children and Men. All the names change for copyright reasons. Pan Am would have to be restructured with new names and some new ideas. It was made to be, to be made publishable. Now, um, I don't think... I've, I've had a thought, and I don't think... I'll be taking the sermons literally into the um, angel side. I don't think I'm going to do that. It's not going to happen. I don't think. What will probably happen, though, possibly, is that they'll be um, somewhat developed and processed into the, the story somewhat. Sort of into you know, original enough dialogue. The information of Blather for not Linus O'Neill, uh, it's not really going to be the literal words which I've been using in the Blather videos, but the information is potentially going to be processed and put into original content with some original thought to develop a Linus O'Neill character. This is not a definite plan yet. It's an initial plan. It's it's a possibility. This none of it, none of this information could come could potentially come to fruition in, in the Angel Saga or I might end up just complete keeping this stuff completely separate. It might never occur. Now some of my preaching is uh, my pre my sermons have sometimes affected my stories. That's been a fault in some of my stories. That's happened from time to time as I've written it out. So it is a natural thing which goes on. So it's that the idea for Linus to use the Blaver stuff, it, it would be in Panem at this stage. I've talked about the Linus character before and the Blaver stuff. But um, it's not a definite, but a possibility. We'll see how it goes.